What's going on? I got me stressed. She squirted at me a little bit. Oh. Oh yeah, that's right. What's two days? Yo, <laughs> yo, bro, you're a bully. All right, guys, today we are going to Heat Wave, Block City event. We got a new tent um, that's the snap on helmet, and then I just got wheels back here. So I don't bring tools, but everybody else brings tools, and I just more I'm about camping. <laughs> this guy this <laughs> knows what I bring. I sent him the list. I haven't changed it. So if he wanted to, he could have brought it. <laughs> So my car is good. The only thing we did do is raise uh, the vehicle and we added a 25 mil spacer because I was rubbing on the inside. And this is this uh, style 330s with a 25 mil spacer and I shouldn't rub now. Uh, I was sweeping the log here. Someone said I sweep like I did here. <coughs> <coughs> Extended brake lines, Zarek Fab. Will come in on the 31st when I bought them. Said they were in stock. It took until the 13th. That's what I mean. Yeah. I bought them on the 22nd. It was supposed to come in on the 31st. Came in on the damn 13th. So if you have a deadline, don't buy from Zarek Fab. <laughs> How about the knuckles? The knuckles? Dustin knuckles. We got the fabulous auto lab. Oh, I already have them packed up. I was going to show you. I'm getting my core deposit back.
very interesting line that I took. taking a quick 30 minute break uh we go back on at 8 got off at 7 30. jose this happened so tell so tell me what what went wrong because that nothing went right uh i went a little too wide on the big sweep and instead of heading where i wanted i headed straight to the wall <laughs> tell by <I> first <laughs> And then, then we start getting bigger and
so I need to take my wheel off because Dante, the Dante the tool guy, doesn't have a 22 millimeter wrench. This guy, this motherfucker, <laughs> knows what I bring. I sent him the list. I haven't changed it. So if he wanted some shit, he could have brought it. <laughs> Kind of. I mean, you could see the whole wheel moving. So that's why. If I had a wrench, I could do it like this. So we're doing a small operation. Operation flat tire. What happened? You got a flat. driving today i have so much driving video footage and dante forgot his gopro so i told him i'm gonna record yesterday and i'll let him use um whatever today and then he was in my car for the first hour so we got a couple couple of those but i mean there's nothing more i could really record you guys know where i'm at you guys see how i'm doing and i'm just gonna keep getting better hey nate i decided to get this shot for your video because i can see you're clearly not recording <laughs> Dude, you may have sent it a little too hard. So, um, yeah, sick. So, the bolt snapped. I thought it came loose, but it just snapped inside. Dante's doing body work, but I can I can un, I can loosen this with my finger. See it spinning. Oh! The bolt must have stretched or something, and then it broke. But I'm not worried. Um, if I can't drive home, I can't drive home. Just call AAA, and then I'll just throw Dante's stuff in here, and then I'm getting a ride home with him. That's how much broke. Do you think I can just thread this on? It's a little bit left. My favorite guy, Scott, got me right. Now we're, dude, almost perfect just in case he gave me a washer. But dude, I like can't thank the community here enough. Like this is, I wouldn't have driven home if I didn't get this. Or we would've just gone to Lowe's and picked one up. But still, that's like crazy. I appreciate everyone here. Awesome. All right, right now, uh, Dante's just securing the headlight back in because I don't have all the bolts in for it. Um, and this is kind of loose, but we're back up and running. I don't know if you can see that. I can't really see where I'm looking. So I try to take this off and then obviously put the, this one on. So I don't know if I'm gonna go off for another lap. We have like another hour, but we're probably just gonna take it around and make sure obviously things move. All right, so we got it all back together. Only thing is the inner tie rod has a little bit of play. So I'm gonna have to change that out before it's staggered. But, so I'm not gonna be driving for the rest of the day, but we're just gonna go watch Skid Pad until it's time to go. Me and Jose, our cars are tired. Yeah. All right, so right now we're trying to fix the hood. Uh, from latching, Jose got himself into a fender bender and the hood is out of alignment now. Uh, pretty good. I think could hammer this up a little bit. 
definitely going to need a new hood because it's like shifted way left. But we tried um, loosening this up and then just latching it, see if it'll latch, and I think it's it's not latching at all. Um, that looks like it might be a little bent. Not, uh, you know, because it looks like it's coming up a little bit. I don't know if it's supposed to be like that. You know, like how this is coming like this way? Yeah. But yeah, we're fixing him up. My car's back together. I gotta start packing. Um, I'm looking, I'm looking a little like Jason's car right now, with no, no fender. But I have uh, quarters on the way. I got, I ordered overs and quarters like a week ago, so I'm not even tripping. So, cause they would have just got junked anyway, or well, I probably would have put them on up on my place for maybe like 20 bucks or something. But it just saves me the time. Anyways, uh. How how today go, Dante? <laughs> did you did you see a hub centering ring? Tell me, because uh, oh, you lost it. Oh, I thought I put it. So this is is this the bad one? Yeah. Okay. This one isn't as bad. Yeah, it's just the layout. Yeah, it's because there's a reverse. I got